everyone here's a question on expressions uh, the question is a man traveled two fifth of his journey by train one third by bus one fourth by car and the remaining three kilometer on foot what is the length of his total journey now what they have given they have given that a man traveled and they have given different fraction that is two fifth of his journey by train one third by bus one fourth by car and remaining three kilometer by on foot and we have to find out its total journey now since everything is given in terms of his total journey like one fifth of his journey and one third of his journey so we have to assume that total distance to be some variable so here i'm going to assume that total distance to be x so here let total distance total distance of his journey be equal to x now they have given by train he traveled two fifth of it so by train it is equal to 2 by fifth of the total journey total journey is x so of means multiplication so 2 by 5 multiplied by x which is equal to 2x upon 5 so same thing we have to do by 2 for the bus and by the car so by bus it is equal to so by bus it is equal to one third one third by bus so 1 by 3 of x so when you multiply it will be x upon 3 and by car it is given one fourth one fourth by car so one by four of x which is equal to x by four mm, and the remaining it is three kilometer now we know that if i add all this distance all this fraction if i add up it should be equal to total distance that is total journey right like we have given two fifth by train and the remaining by bus and again remaining by car and the remaining by foot so if i add up all this thing it should be equal to total distance and we have assumed total distance to be equal to x so this will be this should be equal to x so let me write down here so total distance will be equal to that is distance traveled by train and the distance traveled by the car and by the bus and then the remaining by foot so we have to add all this thing so total distance we have assumed x and by train it was two fifth so two by fifth five two by five of x plus by car it was one fourth so it will be x by four plus by bus it was one third so x by three and the remaining it was given that it is three kilometer so i'm gonna add three kilometer to this so you have to just add to x by five x by three x by four and the three kilometer so three kilometer so if i add all this thing it should be equal to the total distance which we have taken x now we have to solve this equation so what we're going to do i'm going to transpose every uh, fraction to the left hand side because we have to bring all the variables one side so all 2x by 5 x by 4 x by 3 i'm going to transpose this to the left side so x signs will change all are positive when you transpose the sign will change to negative so minus x by 4 then minus x by 3 is equal to 3 now you can see here this is 5 uh, we, we have a fraction here and we have one whole number x means the coefficient here will be 1 so we cannot subtract them so we're gonna take a LCM of denominator we're gonna make the denominator same so we'll take the LCM of so here x uh, can be written as x by 1 so we're gonna take a LCM of 1 5 4 and 3 so when you take LCM it is equal to 60 now our task is to make the denominator 60 so for the first number I have to make this 160 so I have to multiply 60 in the numerator and denominator so x by 1 I'm gonna multiply here with 60 then minus the second number I have here is 2 by 5 so 2x by 5 so with 5 what I should multiply to get 60 so it is uh, 12 so 12 5 is a 60 so I'm gonna multiply here with 12 then minus x by 4 so with 4 what I should multiply to get 60 so if you don't know you can divide 60 in case if you don't know with what number you should multiply six, divide 60 by 4 so this will be 4 ones are 4 the 2 will be left so 15 so 15 4s are 60 you can even do like that so I'm gonna multiply here 15 in the numerator and denominator minus x upon 3 
so with 3 what I should multiply to get 60 again if you don't know you can divide 60 by 3 and get the answer it will be 20 so going to multiply 20 in the denominator and numerator and this is equal to 3 now when I solve this it will become 60 x by 60 minus 12 into 2 is 24 so 24 x by 60 then minus 15 x by 60 again minus 20 x by 60 is equal to 3 so you can see that all the denominators are same so we have to just subtract the uh, numerators and get the uh, answer so when you solve this further so we'll get here 60x minus what we have 24x minus 15 so 24x minus 15x minus and the next we have here is 20x so 20x is divided by in the denominator will get 60 is equal to 3 so we have to subtract them so 60x minus so you can see that all this number have a same sign negative sign so in you have learned this in integer that when they have a same sign you have to add and the sign will be the negative sign so I'm gonna add them so 24 and 50 and 20 just add them we'll get here 40 uh, 59 Okay, 50, 59 and we have to put the same sign which will be negative sign so we'll get 59 x upon 60 is equal to 3 so 60 x minus 59 x will be 1 x so 1 x upon 60 is equal to 3 now we're going to transpose 60 to the other side because you want only the x value now 60 is in division and transport comes in multiplication so from here you can write down 1x or simply x so x is equal to 3 multiplied by 60 which is equal to 180 so x value we got as 180 kilometer which means total distance of his journey is 180 kilometer so therefore total distance will be equal to 180 kilometer so this is important question and this can come for 4 mark this type of questions can come for 4 mark and in case you have any other further question or doubt you can drop a comment thank you so much for watching